Do you feel that you're getting many air quality warnings these days? Too many alerts, worried about them? At Ecosystem Informatics, we do. And we care about this. My name is Shuruk Ali and I'm the founder. Citizens are holding governments and industries accountable for the quality of air that they breathe. The current technology to monitor air quality, however, is expensive and bulky. It's the size of an elevator. Because it's stationary, it samples air from a specific point rather than points of interest or where it matters. In the US, they started to put lab-grade equipment into cars to drive and, and monitor in hotspots, but that's even more expensive option. Neither of these options pro uh, pr uh, provides a sufficient insights for driving decision-making on air quality. At Ecosystem Informatics, we've solved all of these limitations. Let me show you with a technology of smart sensor systems what we can do. This is one of our pilots that's running in Hamilton. Units are deployed in the field, collecting environmental and meteorological data, for example, in Hamilton Sulphur. Data is connected to the cloud where it's calibrated uh, with our AI-driven intelligence, and all of that complexity is given to the user with a simplified web-based dashboard. Our solution is nimble. It could be fixed or mobile. It no doesn't need a technician to run it. It's relevant, measuring where it matters at a very granular and accurate level. It's affordable to the customer. Our low-cost sensors offer a scalability option. Our target customers are governments and industries at this point, that we're approaching them through direct sales and through channel partners. We own, build, and manage the hardware and offer it to them as a loan. Our projections show that by 2023, we're looking at a more than 80% profit margin. With our sectors, we're looking at more than half of the air monitoring market. We also see a licensing opportunity for our algorithms, giving us a total market share of about $11.6 billion. We developed the initial technology while uh, being paid by the Ministry of Transportation Ontario. Within two years, we were able to complete three field tests, start to generate revenue, and project more than $2 million in revenue by 2023. My team and I bring more than 100 years experience in business and in technology. With our advisors and partners, we are ready to commercialize. The biggest takeaway from our discussions with the uh, pillar judges was the importance of fine-tuning our messaging. We envision ourselves to be part of the solution when it comes to air quality. A win in this competition can kickstart our commercialization. You can't manage what you don't measure. Let's try to apply this for air quality. It's time. Thank you.